All right, yo. So here we are. We're back in Roseway. We're uh, we have a problem. We're kind of trapped. Um, we got to figure out how to get out without getting spotted, cause uh, they don't like us. We maybe don't want to have a whole firefight with them at this point. Didn't we kill Weldon already? At the other spot. But they don't, obviously they don't like us anymore. Uh, we killed Nanton, remember? He didn't like what we told him about his, uh, about his research. So, we have to figure out a way out of town without getting spotted and, uh, blast it to infinity. Keep him quiet, Cap. So far, so good. Can we go in here? That's not a door either. Mm, so we need to escape without them realizing uh, we're escaping. I really got to stop getting the buttons wrong. We're going to eat uh, two pounds of wrapped on meat. It don't do shit for us, but it's going to make us unencumbered, which is super important right now. It would be nice if we had a friend to help us who liked us. I do have a corporation service award though. Can I? A climb button would also be useful here. Alright, he's not paying attention to us. Problem is, this my man's right here is posted up on the corner. He currently sees us. Alright, whatever. So much for sneaky. Damn, uh, guys? Yeah, this is still a tough one. Um, so, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have to create a choke, pl choke point. Um, because, uh, doing that didn't work for sure. Make sure all our weapons are at max ammo. We're just gonna cycle from one to another. We obviously can't just get in a fight with them, so we wanna fight them in this choke point. Gotta remember that that zappy thing uh, hurts like a motherfucker. Oof. We can knock it through. All right, here we go. We have to make sure, basically we can't sneak around him. So we wanna find a good choke hold, choke point, I should say, LOL. Um, because uh, we can't get out of town. We are like trapped in town. I mean, maybe if we can, can we sneak past this guy? Stay out I mean, of sight. He's not looking at us. All right, and we want to remember we uh, killed Anton. Um, we basically told him in the wrong way that his research was some bullshit, and uh, he decided he hated us. Roseway Luxury Apartments. So we got to figure out how to get out of town. Um, the last time we tried to get out of town, we died. Oh right, this place is full of enemies too, because this place is just swarming with corporate guards. Um, yeah. 
and we are not equipped to try and kill all of them. So there's one in there. That's straight. Alright, we're almost to the door. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, that's right. We gotta go still gotta report to Gladys, and I don't know if she's gonna... If they're gonna report us as murderers or not. So, yeah. But we escaped. We escaped. Uh, all in one piece. So, good for us. Alright, so we can probably fast travel. I just want to make sure nobody's gonna, like, kill us, but also check and see what's going on. Um, on our side quest, weapons from the void, distress signal, we're doing that now. Um, that's the medicine thing. Frightened engineer. And Edgewater. Oh, that's the Spacer's Guide. Spacer's Choice guy. The Deserters. The Manuals. Alright. So we're okay for now. Alright, so... Since we're pretty good on all that shit, we're just gonna keep going. If apparently I can't jump over a log, no hops have an ass. I guess it's true in my old age, I can't even touch rim anymore, so I guess my guy can't uh, hop over. I haven't been in cryostasis for a hundred years, he can't hop over a log. This seems fair, I guess. I'm not gonna lie, those little Sprat bu Buddies uh, seem worrying. They seem like eventually they're gonna turn on us all. But uh, yeah, I think we made it out. Thank you for sitting through this uh, three minute filler situation. Oh yeah, I forgot, we got the thing for our giant robot to be a murder mech, I think. So let's see if we can give it to him and if he'll suddenly, like, spring to life. And saw the acid steeper. Hey. Initiating initialization sequences. Greetings, customer! This SAM unit is unable to locate your registered information. Would you like to register your SAM? Register I'm gonna go with yes. Captain! Sand units live to clean and clean to live. All right. That's straight. Yo, chill out. Chill out. It comes lean, mean, and ready to clean. Thank you, customer. This area is utterly filthy. All Sam units travel fully assembled in a 12 by 12 corrugated steel box. Did you know Sam units are capable of equipping regulation grade flamethrower nozzles? Okay. Up your attachment today and get to firing away. Got stubborn stains. Leave them for Sam. Okay. Good to know. I have a cleaning robot. Like a Roomba that can equip f uh, flamethrowers. That's what's up. Let's go ahead and disembark to the groundbreaker. Um... Have you had a moment to look into that little opportunity I told you about on Roseway? You don't hurry up. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. Yeah. What's that? Speak up now. What'd you turn up? Huh. Peaches and cream, if that isn't the most handsome bit of lethal engineering I've seen all week. All right, there we go. That'll go for a tiny sum of bits. These corporations, I tell you, once they get an idea into their big, dense heads, there's no getting it out again. Can't imagine how I'll offload this, but waste not, want not, I suppose. A shame you didn't visit old Gladys first. That would have fetched a good price. I may have thrown in a batch of my famous sugar cookies just to sweeten the deal. Mm. If Auntie Cleo's exporting wraps from Monarch, golly me, 
Someone's going to be in the soup when they get caught. Oh, I don't have enough Are persuasion. Positive? Honest, can't say I wasn't hoping for more, but I suppose it can't be helped. Law bless you for doing the legwork, sweetie. Don't forget. What do you want then? My hard earned wisdom? Yes. Ask the common folk, and they'll tell you it's on account of all the monsters on Monarch desperate to gobble you up. Because that's what the board tells them, you see. I think they made some fool mistake that would make them look bad to the rest of the colony, and they're trying to hide the evidence. Alright. Those board folk are real prideful like. Never want you looking behind the curtain, lest you see their derrieres. But old Gladys knows the score. The whole colony's not much more than a diorama, showcasing one board screw up after another. Okay. That's why we gotta keep them from getting their grubby mitts on Groundbreaker. She's our mess. Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. Oh, how nice. And more importantly, nobody's trying to shoot me right now. That's that shit I'm about. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? Alright, let's see what Wells has to say. Well done. You'll love Monarch. Exotic climate, violent native species, fascinating culture, really. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. <laughs> no, never. Monarch is a hotbed of political activity. I can't imagine why Hiram set up shop there. Cuisine, perhaps? Hmm. I certainly wouldn't call it boring, especially if your idea of fun involves navigating a hostile biosphere populated by carnivorous monsters. Okay. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Neoka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Come see me in my lab. I'll answer any questions you have. Okay. Best of luck. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you. And we got a new level up, so let's see what we can do. Um, I think we want to continue to be a shooty boy. And a talky boy. Why is our stealth so low? Because we have the armor. Okay. That makes sense. So we're gonna just continue to up our dialogue. Alright, cool. And then our perks. Move faster. Increase accuracy moving. I don't even know what companion abilities are. That's what we want. Yep. Alright, so now we're level 10. We're about to set course. He wants us to get this lady to be our guide. I don't really want to get this lady to be our guide. Warning dangerous. You had me at warning dangerous. Yeah. Orbit over Cascadia, Captain. Alright. So it seems dangerous. There's definitely some enemies lurking about. They're moving. And I can't see them. Are they hiding from me? Oh. Okay, they're not. They have names. That seems a little weird to me. They have names. They're not just like... Random murder beast one. Are we supposed to tame them? We're supposed to tame them. I can smell it. Ah! 
That's a long fall. This window just open, open? Nah, okay. me out. The other place is really far away, but the enemy boys aren't really far away. But this place sounds creepy as hell and I love it. Oh, there's some like right ahead. Yo. This person been torched. Um, that's a lot. I don't think that's a good plan. Like, taking a second look at it may have been enough more than we can chew. How do I get back up there? Uh, how do I get back up there? Please, game, don't make this as hard as it could be. Uh, that's a Mega Raptodon? That also seems like bad times. My guy, I need you to jump, like, significantly higher. Right the F now. How do I get back up there? Because we are, uh, we have, uh... We've made some bad life choices right now. How do we get up there? Because there's a couple over here. There's a Mega Raptodon the other way. I don't want to fight a Mega Raptodon. I'm no scientist, but a Mega Raptodon seems not fun. Alright, there's the steps. Can I get to the steps without being spotted? Alright, we're just going to run for it. Nope, we running. We running, homie. You fighting, I'm running. Ah! Everyone all right? Get in the ship. <laughs> that was much. That was a little too much. Um. Why was I built to feel ennui? I don't know, but uh. When I'm in orbit, they should put some sort of warning London. that that looked dangerous. Because that was dangerous. If only someone had told me. Alright. Oh, we got an achievement. It like beeps on our screen, but it doesn't show you guys. Something fishy in Stellar Bay. And uh, yeah, here we are. Okay. I assumed there would be like a down. Probably don't want to jump. Fall damage is pretty harsh in this game. So, uh, how do I get down? So this is gonna be like a mystery. But with a big gun. This looks like a fucking lift, yo. Get me down. Alright. Man. I don't have no knees on this character. Hold on there. Found a flaw permanently crippled. You are unable to dodge, and I'm gonna reject that one. I apologize. Don't think okay. I've seen you around. That means you must be new to Stellar Bay. You are new here, right? Yes. I See, I made what you call a logical deduction. You must have seen those UDL gunships on your way in. There's only three of them these days. Still, they tend to scare folk off. Wish more folk could say that. It gets awful quiet guarding a landing pad that never gets used. You may not have heard, you being new, but Stellar Bay hardly ever gets off-world traffic. Us being cut off by the board and all. Ooh. Which means I never get to do this part, but I've been practicing, so here goes. On behalf of Monarch Stellar Industries, welcome to Stellar Bay, 
home of the freshest Sal tuna in Halcyon. Please state your name for the records. Swell. There's one for the logs. I'm even going to give you your own entry code. I'm not supposed to do that. It's against procedure, but Mr. Sanjar isn't so strict about the rules here. Besides, I got a lot of empty entries to fill. Oh, that'll just yeah. make Mr. Sanjar's day if you tell him. The board makes up lots of nasty stories about raptodons and cannibals and whatnot. But that's all outside our walls. Mostly. Did he just say raptodons and cannibals? I can't wait! <laughs> oh, sure. Felix is height. Felix's height. sound like a rotten place, but it's not so bad. Felix is Get ready to go. And the sulfur smell mostly covers up the fishy smell. Anyway, Mr. Sanjar's got lots to say on that subject. Kinda goes over my head, though. Mr. Sandra will be mighty pleased to meet you. If you see him over at headquarters, maybe you could tell him I did a bang-up job of welcoming you? I'm always oh, down. And if you're headed that way, maybe you could do me a favor? I got this Rizzo's Rangers Toswell poster coming in on the next sublight shipment, signed by the Black Hole himself. Only I haven't heard anything in a while. You think you could check with Celia to see if it's come in? Can do. Punch. Celia works for Mr. Sanjar in the MSI building next to the bar. She's always there, so you can't miss her. All right. No, oh, you don't even have a name, so I don't think I need to worry about you, right? I'm not going to steal that. All right, so we made it here. There's a lot of stuff going on. Of all the times and places we could have been born. Yeah. We're here, light years from Earth, going about our lives. Every time the punch clock peels, a worker earns his meals. What are you talking about? Sorry, I thought you were quoting It's a Wonderful Directorate. Oh my god. I don't know if that's badass or not. Oh, he flexed on me. Well, don't flex on me. I will go brat. Wouldn't know. I made it a point to stay out of her way. I like overhearing all the random conversation they put in. It's fun. It is actually really fun. Are they just going to let me walk out here? Let's see what we got in the surrounding area of Stellar Bay. Uh, it looks like crap. Ooh. Smells like those old Sundays when we'd unload some tuna shipments at the camp. We gotta go exploring. Ooh. Oh, I see some savages. Uh, nobody. Let's back up. Let's just walk away. I get what you want, but uh, I don't want to do that. And what is this? How is this not something I can steal? Ow. Why is it not something I can steal? It's here. There should be some reason for it, right? Come on. Alright, well, I guess not. Let's just, uh, slink back slowly and try not to get killed by the Raptodons. So, uh, yeah, Stellar Bay, surrounded by murder, that's kind of cool, one of those things you never forget, um, yeah, so, uh, we'll investigate the inner workings of Stellar Bay at a later time, um, see y'all next time, thanks for coming through, feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, please subscribe, subscribe and like first, and then comment and share actually um and we'll keep making some more stellar content like this so thank you later internet